Good morning guys, I just finished my workout. And I switched it up today because I did um, some tone it up moves and um, well I needed like a quick workout and um, I wanted to do something different so I did tone it up's uh, booty bikini workout <laughs> I think that's what it's called but um, I did that today I really want to like tighten firm up these buttons I have noticed some changes but I want um, more <laughs> so um, that was my workout for this morning and um, for breakfast I'm having an 8 banana smoothie and I've been um, putting um, coconut water I've been adding coconut water to my smoothies now at least my morning smoothies to just replenish and rehydrate and get in my electrolytes after my workouts and um, I don't like coconut at all I've never been a fan of it and I've um, even when I switched to this high carb low fat vegan lifestyle I thought that maybe I might start to like it, but no, I don't. So, <laughs> so I got Zico coconut water because it has like the coconut is very like faint. It's not as strong as some other coconut waters that I've tried, and um, I can't really taste it at all in my smoothies. So I use like half of the Zico coconut water and then half um, just uh, Brita water. And um, yeah, it's been, I've been feeling good. I like it. Um, can't taste the coconut, and <laughs> I'm getting all the benefits from it, so it's good. Uh, yeah, so um, that's it for this morning. Um, I will try to check in with you guys sometime during lunch, and I um, hope you're having a great start to the day. I'm really tired, but I know once I get in the smoothie, get in that sugar rush, natural sugar rush. I'll be all set. So I'll check in with you guys later. Hey guys, I just finished um, my lunch and I had the space. <laughs> almost hit myself in the face. I had um, three cups of strawberries, two bananas, and five cups of mango juice, and like a teaspoon, well, I just sprinkled, so it was about a teaspoon of chia seeds. And I had that for a smoothie, and it was quite delicious and refreshing, especially with it being so hot outside today. And um, I just finished um, shooting some videos for my other channel, and now I'm just going to do some stretching because, oh, and then I have some other editing to do. <laughs> but I'm going to be doing some editing and some stretching because I have the soreness that has crept slowly crept throughout the day upon my shoulders and I am so sore and tight from I'm I'm guessing it's from my workout yesterday because I didn't do any arms today so <laughs> um yeah I'm just gonna do some stretching and try to get rid of the soreness oh and I'm probably gonna do some um um foam rolling so I know that usually helps it's hard for me to reach like these areas in my foam roller but I'm gonna try my best because I'm sore but um, I will check in with you guys later getting ready to make some um, salad dressing and I have in here some um, half an avocado fresh parsley cherry tomatoes a little bit of this sweet chili pepper sauce it's sodium free and um, some mango juice and fresh ground black pepper. So we're gonna see how this comes out. Okay, so salad dressing is done. I added some lime juice and a little more of the red, well, the chili pepper sauce, and blended it up some more. And now it's on top with some potatoes. So I've got salad, cherry tomatoes, potatoes, and dressing for dinner. Yum!
So I weighed myself and it was just as I suspected. I like didn't lose any weight and as a matter of fact I gained two pounds. And this is from the start of my journey, which has been like I guess like a month and a half now. And this is why I didn't want to weigh myself, because I knew that it just wasn't going to be the number that I wanted. But this is just a month and a half in, and I haven't been sticking to it high carb, low fat, raw till for 100%. You know, I've had some mishaps here, I've had some um, processed vegan food and I've had some vegan junk food and I've had more sodium than I should be having on some days so like I knew it wasn't gonna be I don't know I just knew that it wasn't gonna be what I wanted but I wanted just to check just to see so I'm not gonna weigh myself <laughs> anymore for like maybe three months I'm just gonna like ignore the scale like I've been doing and just focus on just trying to do the best I can on this path because it can be frustrating and I don't know you just want to see results right away but this is a lifestyle it's not a diet so it's not gonna be like quick magic that's gonna take time and I've like I said at the beginning of my videos um, my very first video I like wrecked my body over the holidays with a whole bunch of junk food so I can't expect it just to be overnight so I'm just gonna stay focused and just stay encouraged you guys have been encouraging me so much thank you for commenting on the videos and watching them and liking them it just means so much to me and it's keeping me going and I'm not gonna stop Pretty soon I'll be showing you some before and after pics and I'll be looking back on this and smiling because I came to a crossroad and I kept on the path and I made it through. But I just wanted to share that with you guys because I didn't post it yesterday when I was going to weigh myself. And yeah, I hope you are having a great night and I will be back at this tomorrow, so I will check in with you in the morning. Bye!